How's everybody doing today? So, um, I want to make another quick video. Um, I was talking to a friend of mine about one of the uh, past sermons I did, and it was on the adulterous woman. And unfortunately for a lot of you guys, if you look this up, it's not going to be in your Bible because a lot of Bibles don't have it in there. So you have to get a King James Bible. But the story is about a woman who was caught in the very act of adultery. And a lot of these Pharisees took her and they brought her up into the, the city and they put her in front of Jesus. And they said, Jesus, the law of Moses says this woman should be stoned. She was caught in the very act of adultery. You know, Moses says she should be stoned, but what do you say? And it implies that um, they did this because they wanted to basically find fault in Jesus. And there's a couple interesting things about the story. The first thing is they caught the woman and brung her into the square, but not the man. And the reason why is because a lot of Pharisees would actually commonly be intimate with people. And um, it was just something that they did. And we don't know if this woman was a harlot or if this woman was just, you know, dating a guy and, you know, stuff happened. You know, we don't really know that. But it talks about in the story that um, they, they called Jesus out and said, you know, Moses says to stone the person. What do you say to do? And this is what Jesus did is he basically knelt down and started writing in the ground. And it doesn't say what Jesus started writing in the ground. It just says he wrote in the ground. And some Bible people will say that he um, he wrote down things like um, maybe dates. You know, he put down a certain date and say, you know, somebody in the audience might say, um, well, you know, what happened on this day? And somebody in the audience might think, oh, you know, what happened on that day? Or maybe he wrote down names. You know, names of people that they they hurt or they sinned against or, or they committed adultery with. Or maybe he wrote down names of people, you know, have you ever sinned? Have you ever sinned? And it says in the story that um, beginning with the oldest, the people started dropping their stones and walking away. And this is done because a lot of times the oldest are the ones that have sinned more. I mean, obviously they've been on earth longer, so they've sinned more. Um, down to the youngest, and he asked the people, he said, he that has not sinned cast the first stone. Everybody sinned except for Jesus, so they all know that none of them are worthy to hurt this girl because they've all sinned. And the only person that was worthy to stone the girl was Jesus, and he didn't do it. And after everybody left, Jesus told the woman, where are your accusers? And she said, you know, they're all gone. And he told the lady, he said, go and sin no more. And it's a really interesting story because... Number one, it's not a lot of different Bibles. But it's also really interesting because it's teaching you that, you know, no matter what you've done in your life, no matter how you sin, how you've hurt people, God's going to forgive you and he asks you to go and sin no more. But anyways, guys, I just wanted to um, make a quick video on that. Um, you guys can comment below with any questions or comments. Like the video and I will talk to you guys next time. Have a great day.